Hey guys, it's the Rick here, bringing you another video. It's my top three time. Today's topic is planet substrates. Now you want to start a planet tank. You're going to need a good planet substrate to grow those plants. It's hard to grow healthy, beautiful plants without a good planet substrate, but there is a lot to choose from out there. So I narrowed it down to my top three. So let's get started on this list. Coming at number three for me would be the fluval stratum. Now this is a great planted substrate that can grow all your plants. What's good about this substrate is you don't really have to rinse it and there seems to be no ammonia spike with this substrate. Now it's a very light substrate so I recommend putting about two inches or so of this substrate in your tank so the plants can hold on and stay down. What I find with the fluval stratum is it does lower the pH which is good for your shrimp, but eventually that does go away. Now let's move on to number two on this list. And that's going to be the Eco Complete. Similar to the Fluval Stratum, you don't have to clean it. You can just put it straight into your tank. Now with this substrate, I find it very easy to plant. You can just place your plants right in and they stay in place. What's good about it is it's stable. It doesn't raise your pH and there's no signs of ammonia. Another good thing about Eco Complete is it's affordable and it's a very good planted substrate. So let's move on to the number one on my list, which is going to be the ADA Aqua Soil. Now when you're buying this substrate, you are buying the brand name as well. So it can be a little expensive, but you are purchasing a very good substrate. Now what I find with this substrate is that it does leach some ammonia into the tank. So make sure that is taken care of before you add fish into your tanks. It can be cloudy once you fill it up with water. But give it a day and it will eventually clear. I find with the ADA Aqua Soil, you're buying the best. It grows plants and it lasts a long time. Alright guys, that's my top three for planted substrates. What's your top three? Leave it in the comments below. If you have a suggestion for another top three, leave it below as well. And as always, rate, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.